Welcome to As We Get Older. I'm Laura Orndorff, and in this video, I want to talk about your china, your stemware, and your silver. Now, I can feel the tension already. I, I can feel it. I, a lot of you are immediately going, mm, mm, nope, 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 not giving it up. I'm not asking you to. I have a challenge for you, and it does not involve giving anything up. Hear me out. Now, I'm going to make the assumption that you have the china because um, you know you received it as a wedding gift. Maybe you inherited it from your mother, or grandmother, or whatever reason. But for whatever that reason, you however you got it, you treasure it, and you should. I mean, you know, I have several pieces of my mother's china that I treasure because she loved it. I love it because of that, and that's fine. But my challenge to you, I want you to throw a dinner party plan, I don't know, however many people will fit in your, in your space, but include family members, close friends, but everybody has to have a place at a table. You can't sit on the floor. You got to actually be at a table, car table, whatever. The food doesn't matter. Don't worry about cooking eight hours, three days before. Mm -mm. Order pizza, have everything delivered. The food doesn't matter, but I want you to pull out your china, your stemware, and your silver. I want you to start with the silver. I don't care if only 10 people are coming and you have enough silver for 20. I don't care. You pull out every single piece. Pull out the pickle fork, all of it. Polish every single piece because you treasure it. I want you to look at it. It's like, why did I choose this pattern? You know, if, if you did choose, you know, why did I choose the roses over, you know, what, why did I choose this pattern? Think about it and remember and rejoice in that. After you polish every single piece, you gotta wash it, because you got that polishy stuff over it, put it aside. Then I want you to pull out the china, every single piece. Every dinner plate, every salad plate, every bread plate, every dessert plate, every bowl, every dessert bowl, everything. I don't care if you're having pizza, pull out the gravy boat, all of it. And I want you to wash every single piece. I want you to also, as you're doing, you remember, you know, do you remember that maybe your beloved aunt gave you these two pieces and you know your parents they bought you that special the coffee pot you know, remember remember the stories of each one and hopefully if you have people with you you can share those stories because i want you to remember and just relish in it but you're still washing every single piece every single piece every single piece <laughs> then it's stemware time pull out every single piece of stemware and you're going to wash every tea glass, every water glass, every wine glass, all of it. And then you're going to set the table. Let that china stemware and silver just find a place. Just, just make it, just find a place in your heart. Just make that table. And you know, if you have two or three tables, you know, if you've got a lot of family, you know, the kids table and the kids of the kids table, you know, you've got those kind of tables. Um, every single place has the full dinner plate, the salad plate, the bread plate. Use it all. Take a ton, of, no, no, take two tons of pictures. Done. Just not the proverbial ton, take two tons of pictures because I want you to treasure it and remember it. And maybe you do have like, you know, a few family members who are helping you out and, you know, tell those stories, tell them, you know, relish in it. Then have the dinner. And again, have people ask questions. You know, tell about the first time you used the china or, you know, if at a certain party, you know, something broke or, you know, a beloved cousin who, bless them, they got you just the wrong pattern, but you kept it anyway. You know, whatever. Just tell all of those stories. Because that's the point of families that is sharing that love and those stories. And then when everybody's done, I want you to go to the kitchen and I want you to wash every single stemware, every single piece of china, and every 
single piece of silver. All of it before you go to bed. And then I want you to remember why you never use your china. Now, that's my challenge. We'll talk about what to do afterwards in another video. So, hopefully you'll take me up on the challenge. And again, focus on those memories and sharing the memories and why you treasure that china and why you treasure the stemware and why you treasure the silver. Just tell people those stories because that's what makes it happen. So, if you like what you heard, check out my other videos, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next video.